Hello, today we will discuss about stresses in cow bar. The problem is like that the cow bar has cross sectional area of this like this figure and it is subjected to bending 4 km. Determine the maximum normal stresses developed in the bar. We have to find out uh, stresses at location D point and stresses at location A point. So, first we will find the area of this cross section. So this is simple. This is um, this uh, 50 multiplied by this 50 multiplied by 50. So 0.5 meter square plus this triangle cross section area one half 30 multiplied by this 50. So we will give uh, we will get the area specify here. Now we will find centroid of this uh, location. So first we will find centroid of this one. So this is none of this. This R1. This means 200 plus 250 divided by 2 means 2 to 5 meter. And we will uh, this area. This is none, nothing but uh, summation of R multi multiplied by this area divided by whole area. So this is our this R small r and this 260 it will came 250 uh, 250 plus this 30 divided by 3 because it is triangle so center is it will be here so it is 10 so 250 multiplied by 10 is equal to 260 and again this triangle area divided by whole triangle area this one so we will get r of neutral uh, centroid of this cross section. Now we will find this neutral axis of this beam. So we will find this neutral axis around like this one. So how to find this one? So first we will find neutral axis at this one. Again this one and we will divide by this area. So it is like that only. Really. So uh, integration of dA by dr. It is uh, 0 0.05 multiplied by this R is equal to miss uh, integration len this 200 to up to 250 this 250 so you will get this answer again for triangle I will not go for detail but uh, same way you can find this um, neutral axis and we will find this area divided by this both neutral axis one here and neutral axis here so we will by summation uh, with dividing area we will get our neutral axis uh, answer so it is around 23142 so 231 m, uh, mm around like so it is near about our uh, this uh, this centered of our cross section now we will find our uh, normal spaces m by r minus rb and this is equation now we will go for python for implementation of stress along the thickness we will plot this diagram like this one and uh, we will find out the stress area so first we will go I will um, so I had already written numpy as np import matplot library as plt for plotting our graph import math.m as m and we'll uh, insert our this this is my uh, sorry this is my l1 this is my l2 and this is my l3 so and this is a1 this is a1 a2 and a3 so first uh, and this is m is equal to 4 kilonewton meter so i had converted it in newton into mm so first we will write this area so first i will write a1 is equal to this l1 multiplied by sorry this l1 multiplied by l2 L1 multiplied by L2. A2 is equal to this one half of 30 multiplied by 50. So 0.5 multiplied by 
thirty. Sorry, L three multiplied by L two. Sorry, L one. And total area of this cross section is A one plus A two. So A one plus A two. So we had find total area. Now we will go for this. This centered axis of this cross section area. So first, I will go for this R1 is equal to A1 plus sorry A1 plus A2 divided by 2 multiplied by A1 means area 1. I will close our bracket again. This uh, L3 divided by 3 by plus summation of this A2. So we'll get this 260 as an answer because up to this area at centered on this one is 250 plus this centroid of this triangle. So L3 divided by 3 multiplied by this A2. I will close this bracket, Sorry. and I will close this bracket in divided by area. So this R1 is centroid. Now we will find neutral axis. So neutral axis we will find this uh, R1 is equal to R1 is equal to Uh, this uh, L2 multiplied by m dot sorry L m dot log this 0.25 means this A2 divided by A1 and R2 is equal to L2 multiplied by this is 280 means A3 divided by L3, sorry, A3 minus A2. I'll close all this bracket. Bracket is very important, guys. So keep it. In. And M dot log A3 divided by A2. So we get our R2 value. This value. Now we'll go for R value. So R is equal to A divided by R1 plus R2. Now we'll find our stresses. So first I'll write this equation: stress at D location m multiplied by R minus R B. R B means this 200 min, uh, mm means up to here. So I'll write A1 divided by area multiplied by R B. Same thing A1 multiplied by R. This R is this one. Our centroid, this smaller, so centroid, centroid minus capital R. Again, stresses at A. Same thing, but this R A. So this is around 280. So I will write A3. And again, this A1 is equal to A3. Uh, stress A, this stress B, and stress A. Sorry, stress A. I'll run this code. I'll not getting. Okay, sorry. I'll not getting result. So I'll find out why. Maybe 
this minus 0.5 I am not dividing so I will divide this with this minus L2 if I run this code I will getting correct value 116 MPa sorry I will delete this print One one six MPa and one two eight point six six is around one twenty eight. So stresses at D. Now we'll uh, plot this diagram. This one one six and this one. So we need a this uh, line point. So we'll create an T dot line space and uh, start with A one two A two. We will divide in 10 division and a333 is equal to np dot line space 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 a2 multiple uh, a3 and 10 division and I will change this value to a11 a11 a33 and a33. I will delete this one and we need uh, plt dot plot we need x as a, our stress value and y is our height so stress pb sorry I will try with stress a and a33 stress pb and this a11 I will run this code here you can see that uh, our uh, stresses means uh, deformation if you plot this line and we will find out this uh, inverted uh, plotting like this one we will get so if we put 100 it will divide by 100 iteration and if you want to grid on so just write plt dot grid and run this command so here you can see that uh, this limit is not visible so I will write plt dot x limb uh, I will say minus 130 to uh, 120 here you can sorry 150 I will write and we will again run it so here you can see that I got the sum graph so by this way you can uh, find out stresses in power beam thank you guys please share and subscribe to my channel